Nishad says, when I reached the masjid, the congregational prayer was over. Is it better for me to wait for someone to come so I can pray uh, uh, jama'ah or prayer alone? Which is best? We all know that the Prophet ﷺ had told us that the prayer in congregation is better than 25, and another narration, 27 times than the prayer of an individual. So if you come to the masjid and you find that the congregation was over, it is best for you to wait for a few minutes if you're hoping that someone as late as you would come and join you in praying congregation. And it is not true what some Muslims believe that only the first congregation is allowed and anything afterwards is void. You should pray alone and not pray a second or a third jama'ah or a third congregation. This is not true because the Prophet ﷺ once concluded Fajr prayer and after he finished the Salat, one of his companions came late. So the Prophet ﷺ addressed his congregation who had prayed Fajr and who know that praying voluntary prayer after Fajr is not permissible because this is time of restriction and prohibition. Yet, the Prophet ﷺ told them, who among you would go and give charity to this latecomer? Meaning, who among you would pray with him so that they both would be praying congregation and it would be charity from him upon his brother. So this is an, a seal of approval from the Prophet ﷺ for forming a second congregation, not that it is recommended or something to be praised, but rather it is to encompass people's needs and necessities. People have needs. Maybe they were late for a legitimate reason. Why deprive them from the, re the reward of a, a congregational prayer? So this is permissible for you to wait if you Hope that someone will come and join you, insha'Allah. A is for Allah, nothing but Allah. Ba is the beginning of Bismillah. Ta is for taqwa, bewaring of Allah. And tha is for thawab, a reward.